Okay, and we just saw Asbel lose to the cow at a game, so yeah. let us move on to Verona and never speak of that again. <laughs> I don't know. Calling it a game is a generous compliment. I mean, it implies Asbel had a chance to win. Hey, cows are awesome. They are awesome. Uh, there's no doubt about that. I mean, there is nothing wrong with losing to a cow, especially when you're an 11 year old and that's like a true Windor cow. You're an 11 year old beating up egg pairs. Yeah, exactly. He's I beating mean, up I, egg bears. I even think he could handle a cow. No way, because the cow's docile. He doesn't want to hurt it. Fair enough. I'll, I'll give you that. Then he'd be an even bigger jerk than I already think he is. Uh, Damn, I really you know that there's oh, You know that there's something on the other side. That is definitely the way to go, but you know that you, you want to go the other way. I do. I do. Let's just waste an episode going No, that is direction. That is total RPG-like logic. Oh, wait, are we going the right way? No, wait, no, there, there's just cows here. Move. Move. One of these has got to make a noise that's not normal. Like, uh... Shazu! <laughs> it's from Family Guy. That's like the German cow or something. Uh, I, I don't remember that. <laughs> uh, it, it was when Stewie had the um, Simon Says or whatever game that talks about animals and it was a European version. It's like, the cow says, Shazu! And he's like, where? Where does the cow say that? <laughs> that's awesome. And then later in the episode when they're in Germany, they're, they find a cow and it says that. And he's like, okay, we're somewhere in Europe. <laughs> Safe point. Yeah. I'm needing one of these. Have you? Oh, we didn't even travel that far. Actually, you're right. Wow, yeah, this game is... Everywhere. This game is really generous with the safe points. Yeah. Which I, I think is good, because... You know, what if you have to go somewhere and you can't really, yeah. you know... You don't want to undo all your progress. Exactly. I mean, it's direction? it's good, but it's not, like, Eternia good. Eternia had the best, like, Quick save... save. Yes, yeah, save Quick anywhere. Save. This guy looks awesome. The resident? No, this guy. What the seaweed from Lake... Aw, oh, I guess I don't get to read it. I feel like try something. No. Oh, okay, he gave you seaweed. There's a turtles there. You got it. I got it. Transport's not run at the moment, but if you need to Oh, it's just the transport guy. Wait, I, oh, okay, you can. Uh, dualize. Oh, okay. Yeah, talk to him and just dualize stuff. Yeah, quit dualize. Alright, we've done this! Why is it telling us? Just click on something and it'll see what you can dualize with. Alright. See, you can make low fruit. With the name of the A mysterious fruit that shines at night. You can sell it at two whatever golf. That's nothing. I think we should save it. Go to the water. egg and milk or try making food. I don't see you can make fried I rice or puddings. Pudding. I'm more of a rice man. Oh yeah. Yeah, see? And it made two. Well yeah, because I put two in. Oh. Pudding. Pudding. Sure, why not? Oh now, now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> That pudding looks good, too. I'm not gonna lie. Another right. save point? Yeah, I'm telling you, this game is really generous with save points. So, I say we gotta fight this guy. No. You guys can ride for cheap. Ten bucks. Verona uh, Fort, yeah. That's where we're supposed to go? Yeah, we're heading to the capital of Verona. Is that what it's called? Uh-huh. I thought they just called it the capital. No, they call it, uh, the capital's name is Verona. Got it. Is it's just their kids. Of course they're gonna call it the capital. Well, Sophie is debatable. She doesn't remember. She thinks she's 14. She's 14? Is that a spoiler? No, she said that. Oh. Remember Asbel asked her? Oh, right, in the first episode. Yeah, Asbel asked her, how old are you? And he said, um, 14, I think. Oh, this is nice. Um, I, I other than just crashing into that piece of land. Yeah. You know, just a little crash. Are we playing? No. Oh, okay. Just a really is, long. Is this your first boat ride? I don't know, but I'm nervous. My heart is fluttery. She's so scared. As soon as I saw the capital. Oh, she's scared of that place. I'm excited to be nervous. You are. Good for you. Ed. Yeah, I mean, wouldn't it be awesome for you and me to jump in a boat and sail around the world? You and me. I feel like I've heard this conversation. Well, other people could come, like Hubert and Sharia, and maybe even Richard. We'd have so much fun, you'd forget to be nervous. And then we could sail around and try to recover your memory. That sounds nice. 
Hey, we're almost to Barona. Boy, are Hubert and Richard gonna be surprised to see us. And your dad, too, because, you know, you're grounded. Yeah, <laughs> I don't think he thought this through. He's 11. Even I knew to stay in my room when I was grounded back then. Uh, I always found loopholes to when I got grounded. I knew something. Like when my parents oh, would ground me from video games and anything like that, I would make sure to remember what they said. And like we got, we had a computer at the time, and I'm and they're like, okay, you can't play video games, you can't go outside. I'm like, okay, fine. Uh, you didn't say anything about the computer, so I'm just gonna go ahead and be on the computer then. Just spend all day on the internet. Yeah, pretty Which much. Which is a video game in It's itself. not a video game. I was talking to random strangers online. <laughs> that explains a lot. <laughs> Can I go through this? No! <laughs> there's, got, there's something over there. There's that nothing corner. there. It's just cool. You know, I'm thinking that this game has a good amount of cutscenes and they're pretty long. What if we try to do Seno Saga, which is like notoriously known for 20 plus Bad cutscenes. cutscenes. <laughs> We just do little, like, hand-drawn animations with the gist of it. Especially for the second part. We're better off drawing the character models. Those ones are hideous. <laughs> Corona of Offspring. Man, this city is huge! It's nothing like life back in Lawn. Yeah, it is pretty big. Yeah. I really like when they make these capitals actually feel what? big, though. What are you doing here? Sharia? What are you doing here? Oh, I should have known you couldn't stay away, Asbel. So what are you doing here anyway? I'm looking for someone who might know Sophie, but I also might swing by the Night Academy. Oh, and I'm definitely going to visit Richard. <laughs> He's the prince, Asbel. You can't just waltz into his castle and start yakking away. Watch him. Sure I can. That's why he gave me this. Yeah, don't you remember? Yeah, the, the ring. ring of the professor ring. <laughs> Don't call it that. Any ring, this ring proves I'm Richard's friend. Bitch. <coughs> Come on, follow me to the castle, and I'll show you what this baby can do. In our party? Ish. She's accompanying oh. us. Remember, she doesn't know how to fight. She's sickly. Yeah. Why would she? Yeah. Yeah, she, she's sickly as a little girl. What's Why would she know how to fight? You? She's excited. Oh, what? I mean, they so nice. The weather is fine. There's so much nature to see. I'm here from Strata, and it's certainly been worth the trip. That's a good question. How long were we on that boat? I don't think we were on there for that long. Strata's a whole different country. Uh, Lons is still part of a uh, Windor. Sounds like you could have reached it by land. No. Uh, didn't you see? It was a peninsula. You're here to see the prince. Are you kidding me? I was born and raised in Verona. I haven't seen his highness in person once, ever. I have this horrible feeling that when we show them the ring, we're going to get tossed in jail. Yes, yeah, so they're gonna toss an eleven-year-old girl, girl, boy in jail. No, too late. It's a girl. <laughs> well, I don't know how she, old she is. I think at oldest she's probably like ten. Bar. We are now going in the bar. What a sin. <laughs> the Lord of Lawns is in there. We we are not going in there. Wait, I think the sign had something. Did it? Yeah, go to the sign. This is a news bulletin. Okay, never mind. Not that way, that's where we came from. Lost! The city's not that huge! I mean, it's big, but it's not oh, that Oh, there big. we go. Yeah. Forgot I had this. Wait, they were just saying how big the city was a minute ago. Well, it's big, but the amount of places that we can travel is not as big. Fair enough, it's all just aesthetics. What you're trying to say. Yes, it's just aesthetics. There, right. see, look at that. We just left the lower city. Might be a good place to take a break. Wait, hold up. Um, go that way. All right. Yeah. Yeah, you keep going. Yeah, keep going that yourself. way. Yeah, go there. Yeah, that's the Knights Academy, and somewhere around there. Oh wait, no, that's not the right place. Anyway, one of those areas has a um, a stat uh, statue of Kratos. Does it? Yeah. We gotta find this place. Yeah, we'll we'll find it, but okay. we won't find it in this spot, in this episode. <laughs> 